Hi everyone, Simona here from Vector Twist. We are now on day 11 of our series 12 Days of Christmas, and today I would like to show you the Align panel and how to distribute things. Now let's say for example you want to create a pattern. You go ahead and you create your shapes, and then you want to distribute them. So let's open up the Align panel, and of course you've seen the Align panel before, and you know how you can align things vertically, centered, and distribute even objects. But I would like to show you something more. I would like to show you how you can set a specific value for the distribute. So let me start just creating a few squares. And then I'm going to fill them with a different color. So I've got my color palette here. Of course, I'm still in a Christmas mood. And as you can see, they distribute it equally. And of course, if I just move them around a little bit and then select them all, I can again distribute them evenly. But I would like to set the value in between the shapes here. Right now we don't see anything in the Align panel that will help us to do that. You could of course use Guides or the Grid, but the Align panel can help us. And all we have to do is click on the Flyout menu, select Show Options, and then we get an extra field. We'll see Distribute Spacing. And we have a field here that's right now grayed out where we can set a specific value. Now for example, if I select both of them here, and I would like to have a distance of let's say 10 points in between. The field is still grayed out. We have to do one more thing. Over here where it says Align To, we'll need to switch it from Selection to Align To Key Object. Now my key object is highlighted with a blue border, and now I can set the value. The field is now available, and now I can select either Horizontal Distribute or Vertical Distribute, and it will set this exact value in between my shapes. So let's press Horizontal Distribute Space, and now it made 10 points in between those two. Of course I can select them all, go back to Align 2, select Align to Key Object, and then press again Horizontal Distribute Space. Now the distance in between all of my shapes is 10 points. The same way, of course, works for the vertical. So let me just make a few copies here, and let's for example say I would like to have that same space in between. So I'm just going to select my bottom row and group it, select the top, select both, switch back to Align and choose Align to Key Object, and then set 10 points for the Vertical Distribute Space. And as you can see now I have in between my shapes 10 points horizontally and vertically. The Distribute Spacing option is really helpful if you want to set a specific value between your shapes, and especially for pattern creation. And this is it. I just wanted to share this small tip with you, and I hope this will really help you. And if you liked it, please leave a comment below, and remember to subscribe to the Vector Twist channel here. And also check out the blog and go to VectorTwist.com for more tips and tricks. And I'll see you tomorrow for our last day of 12 Days of Christmas. So stay tuned.